shot every day, nigga. You be a right, nigga. You tough, right? Say, run that back. <laughs> that is that too poppy right there. <laughs> That's Word. a fact. <laughs> Yo, yo, yo. Y'all already know. Talking shit with Frost. Episode 13, yo. 13, man. What they say, the lucky lucky number 13? Man, we going crazy, man. Crazy. 13, yo. Come on, man. Locked in, man. He's got to stop playing Unstoppable, with Unstoppable, man. Feel it's me? the dynamic duo right here, man. You know Word. what we doing every week, man. That's a fact. That's a and, fact. And fuck all that Tuesday shit. We back on the Monday, <laughs> Yeah, yo. we back they on trying Monday. trying to throw off the algorithm for us and shit. They Word. hating this shit, yo. Yeah, they know we about yeah, to really man. bring an impact to this shit. You feel bro. me? That's a friendly. We going crazy. But who is that? That was True Poppy. You just yeah, did an yeah, interview yeah, with him. Yeah, yeah. Tap Shout out my with boy. That shit, yo. That's a real. fact. All that. Video yeah, going good crazy. Dude, good dude, too. Yeah, that's, that's going fact. right there. Mm-hmm. And I know my son got some new shit. I see him doing that's some fact, shit the yo. other day, so I know he working. So shout yo, out to him. and shout out Currency Crew. Yeah, man. That's a fact. Facts. You see me with the hat last week. Yeah. Shit going crazy. Tapping with all, all my people close on. Persuave yeah. going crazy. That's you feel me? Devon Silver Lining going and, crazy. And too? Oh, yeah. My cousin, man. She got her own... Oil for the yeah. bed and all that. My shit going crazy in a week, man. Make sure Yo, y'all, y'all tap, tap in, in with Tamara Styles. Y'all trying to grow your head? Yeah. Back, tap in, bro. Stop bro, losing all Shit smell fibers. good. How your shit feeling Pepper good me. and all that. We're going to post me? it right there. So tap in with Tamara Styles. She got all type of oils for y'all. Not just for the, the bed. That's the bed butter right there. Mm-hmm. But you feel me? She got all type of oils and shit. So check her shit out for sure. That's a fact. Yeah, man. So what's so, going on, man? What's oh, going yeah, on this week? Hold on, hold on. And... We sponsored by Born Original. Oh, yeah. We yo. can't stop it, man. Yo, the Fronto going chill. crazy, man. It's in the streets, you man. You see that? They call them requesting the Fronto in the streets, man. They asking me fight. for it. And I can't even lie. So I'm definitely out here. We just going to flood, flood the streets with it, man. You That's already know. It's coming through, man. So what's good this week, man? How you so, been, man? I've been... I've been great, y'all. I've been working on this doc. I ain't gonna lie, man. man. The oil together, got bro. your bed glistening. Yeah, it's it's right 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 out, yo. <laughs> you saying that like y'all got to Yeah, y'all got to tap in, bro. Tap I ain't here. gonna hold you, bro. Y'all here. That's <laughs> a fact. But yeah, but what's good, cuz? What's yeah. going on, man? You know? Shit, just working on that doc for real. Like, I'm yeah. trying to get it together, you know, trying to get everybody else, you know, on it. That's a like, fact. Like, I ain't about to stress niggas to be on this dock because it's about to go up. Anyway. Nah, you ain't even got to so do that. Me? It's about like, you. Yeah, that's a fact. So, you feel me? Yeah, ain't nobody going to be able to tell your story better than you. Like, that's a fact. You feel me? So, you just got to keep doing your thing, man. But what's been going on crazy? Nah, this? fuck that. What you oh, been up to this week? Oh, man. I, I know I'm you been dealing with, with the craziness yeah, yesterday. Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah, man. My whip went crazy yesterday. <laughs> shut down on me. But, you know, we back in motion, man. Yeah, you know, I ain't out of motion too long, bro. Can't so, stop him, yeah, bro. Yeah, steady motion, man. Can't so stop. Fast. Won't stop. You feel me? You feel me? But, yeah. 
Other than that, though, mm -hmm. you, I'm blessed, man. I can't complain, man. That's Everything right. had provided, you feel me? Yeah. Wife happy, kids happy, happy life. Mm -hmm. man. I can't complain, bro. That's a fact. That's a fact. But yeah, man. But was, we missed something last yeah, week. Yeah, last week, you know, that algorithm yeah. fucked us up. So, you know, this PNB Rock situation. Yeah, yeah. You know, R.I.P. to him. Like, yeah. I actually fuck with him, like. Yeah, like I his music. realize a lot of yeah. people fucked with him, as like, I see now, after you feel me, the situation, but he was out of the game, though, like, he was trying to get back in, Yeah, and, yeah, and yeah. according to sources, you feel me, he really wasn't, niggas wasn't fucking with him, bro, yeah. niggas wasn't answering his calls, mm -hmm. responding, so it's just crazy how it would play out, but what's with going that, on with do, it, though? Do you feel, like, we already know the situation. Everybody yeah. already know the situation. Right. So, from there, do you feel like it was a setup between, from his shorty? It's, it's shaky, we, man. Yeah, we gonna be real on this. Be it's real. Shaky. You feel me? It's shaky. Like, at the same time, like, you feel me? We got a platform, so I gotta still be, like, a little bit responsible on mm -hmm. how I speak on things. You feel me? Yeah. Regardless. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, it's shaky, bro. It's, it's not looking. It's, it's not, not looking, looking good too good. It's not looking too good on her end, bro. I ain't gonna mm -hmm. lie. A lot of fingers being pointed and a lot of questionable activity That's before and after the fact. So it's just like, but you know, we gotta think about the world we living in the, these days, mm -hmm. where a person that close to you, they they Damn. always say it's the people that's closest close to, to you that do something crazy. Yeah. And then what? Be about money. Yeah, it be about the bad. The motive. The That's... motive is always money behind it. Yeah, man. I mean, it's the motive for everything, bro. Some people people worship money, bro. Yeah. So they willing to do anything to have it and keep yeah, it. Yeah, that's a good point you made. Nowadays, that's what everybody worship is mm -hmm. money, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, a lot of relationships is broken because of money. Yeah. If Like, a nigga would feel like you could owe a nigga $20. Mm-hmm. It's twenty dollars. You know mm -hmm. how big that shit is nowadays, but it's still the principle of money. Yeah, niggas is not fucking with you. Yeah, I don't really. You on that note, you, you talking about a nigga owing? It's not about the money with some niggas, mm -hmm. like nigga like me. Like it's never about it. I don't care if yeah. it's a dollar. It's the fact you owe me, nigga, and you you feel me? It's a principle. You just yeah. gotta pay what you owe. That's it's just fact. that simple, bro. Because That's it's a, a it's a way. It's it's just respect. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Because it, it's it like if I know you got the dollar, you feel what I'm mm -hmm. saying? <laughs> That's a you fact. you owe me a dollar and you pull out twenty dollars. Yeah, or oh, I see you with that. Yeah, you, you pull out a bank loan of money and you owe me twenty dollars. It's like yo, hold bro, on, bro. bro. Come on, like now I'm gonna you... just get something in right. front of you and just be like, yeah, you got it, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like so that's where principle come in. It's about yeah. the principle. You that's feel me? Fact. It's what you stand on. But think about it. What people do for money, bro? You feel me? You got people really going against everything morally. You got that's chicks crazy. flying out. Doing whatever it takes for the bag, bro. Yeah. They don't even want to talk to you if you ain't talking about a bag. Females now, that's what they bout. Mm -hmm. It's the dollar first and love second. Because they ain't really even fucking with love. Fuck, fuck all the love shit. Yeah. They worried about the bag more. And that's why it's like, I'm seeing now. You see like the generation now is saying, oh yeah, get your bag now. Fuck love. Mm -hmm. It was never like that before. You get what I'm saying? It yeah. was really before that. Our generation or your generation was you find somebody you, you love, y'all get the bag together. That always was it. Now these niggas is so selfish. Everybody is selfish nowadays. Yeah, it's they, cutthroat. For keeps, bro. Mm -hmm. Everybody's for keeps. It don't matter. Just like this. You could be the baby mother. Yeah, yeah. And know, hey, I put out an insurance uh, policy yeah. Yeah, on this nigga. And I know he's worth at least his net worth. He could have did it for her thinking like if something happened to me on some, other, what I'm oh, yeah, some other street shit. So you protected. You feel yeah, me? Yeah, of course. But I feel like every... Because I even got insurance mm -hmm. like that to where if something happened to me, mm -hmm. a certain percentage go to my girl and my mom. Mm -hmm. Hey, And you better make sure my mom good. You feel what right, I'm saying? Right, so right. it's just like every nigga puts that in their head, you know, mm -hmm. knowing that mm -hmm. if I got a shorty, I got to take care of this. Right, right, so it's right. just like knowing that if that was her motive behind it, knowing that this nigga really set, set it up like that for you, that's mm -hmm. crazy, bro. Yeah, because look, think about it. He was on the decline. Yeah, so really his was. money not coming in like that, and he probably thinking, people not know he was song right. He was writing songs for a lot of niggas too. Yeah, but he wasn't eating, bro. He yeah, wasn't yeah, eating he like wasn't he, was he was yeah, decent. He was decent. He was rap nigga decent. Like mm -hmm. I'm not saying he was broke, cause yeah. you know he probably had he had a lot of shit going on, bro. Mm -hmm. he, I know, bro. He a hustler, bro. He yeah, from the hood. He ain't sitting around broke, bro. Right. I'm just saying, <laughs> as far as music wise, 
he wasn't having movement. Like top, like but you got to think street shit. money yeah. compared to rap look, exactly money and all that. Yeah. Difference, things mm -hmm. change. You feel what I'm saying? So I ain't gonna hold you. Mm -hmm. it, she probably seen you feel me she's the person next to him she know what he dealing with what he got going on mm -hmm. and what's going on so she, yeah. she don't want to be living regular let's keep it that's real that's a fact that's a you fact you know what I'm saying bro. it's hard to it, go from being at the high cause what other people gonna say and what she deal with by dealing with a rabble this is what we come to with worshiping mm -hmm. the bag a lot of people, because a nigga got the bag, they gonna put up with a whole bunch of shit mm -hmm. that they wouldn't put up with. Yeah, you feel me? It's that's just for the bag. So, <laughs> so it's just like, yo, like, if you don't got the bag, no boy, hey, shit, she don't want that nigga to go fuck with some mm -hmm. other chick and go get her. You gotta go crazy now. Yeah, go, I just knock him off and get you know collect this insurance money. It's mm -hmm. just that simple, bro. It's like. It's just not far fetched, like uh, you know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I, we are, I'm not sitting here accusing her, but it's just like it's an idea. It's to a me, possibility. I'm just being real. It don't make sense in the middle of Roscoe's chicken and waffles, but, bro. Bro, he's supposed to have more sense to that, and that's what I'm saying. This is what goes on. Nah, nah, fuck that, bro. Niggas need to start acting like men, bro. Men need to start being men, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, at the end of the day, bro, if I'm high profile like that, bro, my girl can't tell me where we going to eat, bro. Especially if it's a food chain. Yeah, yeah. That's I'm not right. going in. I'm no, just not going. I'm, this is what. <laughs> this is the that's thing. number even one. Now, I don't like, care. Like, even now, like. Because girls don't understand sometimes. And they yeah. can, she could be like, ah, you pussy, you saw, but yeah. shit, what happened? Can you feel <laughs> That's me? exactly what it means. Yeah. yeah. Pussy, nigga. But yeah. we living, though. <laughs> And exactly. You feel me? And if it's that, you feel me? Yeah, that's a fact. It is bro. what it you is, bro. Lying. Like we, you, you is checkers, bro. It's not chess, bro. Especially if you the type of nigga that's like, yo, bro, I'm not giving up my jewelry. It's like you playing Russian roulette with the streets. Eventually, you gonna lose, bro. Exactly. He could have ate there before thirty times, and, and it's it been is five. that one time. Yeah, because you playing Russian roulette. You feel bro. what I'm saying? It, it's just a matter of time before you feel me. These niggas is hungry. Shit is looking like real life GTA. We were That's just what I'm about saying. That like shit. LA is not the place to be right now. Like, yeah, mm. y'all could go and visit and all that, but y'all gotta know, stay on the tour. Nah, the tour is not even safe, bro. Nah, but niggas gotta, gotta, know, niggas bro. gotta know you how. Niggas gotta know how to move, move bro. bro. That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, yo, bro, I'm gonna keep it real, bro, because I was just talking to one of the G's about this shit, the OGs. You feel me from back mm -hmm. in the days and shit. Yeah. And like, like my pops and them ever, bro. Like, you see them niggas with the big jewelry. That's why them niggas got pictures of these niggas. Cause, yeah. bro, these niggas was some thorough niggas. Like, yeah. bro, then weenies bro. wasn't wearing jewelry. Bro. Let's keep it real. Let's <laughs> be real. Back like, in the day, that you had a lot of weenies. shit you couldn't wear <laughs> if you was a weenie, if bro. A weenie, you bro. couldn't wear no pelly, was, pelly leather. Nah, you couldn't bro. wear nothing. Nothing, Walmart, bro. Jackets, yeah, no, yeah, no yeah, faces. Yeah. Niggas is taking you definitely that Definitely couldn't bro. have no big ass, heavy, Sidekicks. chunky, gold bro, bro. Niggas is taking, if you were Everything, weenie, you bro. getting your jewels took, bro. Everything, bro. It's just like that. You feel me? So street niggas look at these rapper niggas with a hundred thousand dollar watches on and all this weird shit. They be like, Nigga, niggas you are lame for real." Like, yeah. let me get that in bro. the hood though. They like mm -hmm. around them. You That's feel me? Fact. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Ice once team they made them out. Yeah, once they peeped them out, that be they the ain't thing. even got it. It's gang. It's like gang, and it's a gang city. Mm -hmm. So you gotta know how to operate, bro. And I heard he lived out there for a while. I just say that he should have known better. Cause this check is not chess. I can't yeah. blame a girl because you you for a fool for letting her line you. That's My, a fact. You feel me? If I'm high profile and niggas know me and I don't know, that's I'm the thing. Niggas be saying like that crazy. Niggas shit. be saying like yo, rap is the most dangerous job in 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 the um in the world. But I'm gonna explain to you why it's dangerous, right? Yeah. It's because these niggas be knowing who you are, and you don't know who they are. You don't know who these niggas you are. You don't know who anybody so you is. Could, exactly. Niggas. So you could be going, you could be in the mall, a mm -hmm. nigga spot you. He yeah. know who you are. He yeah. like, yo, oh shit. He like, and oh. He making phone calls, taking pictures of yeah. you. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, I got it the drop the on this nigga. It could be the weenie. Exactly, But bro. he connected, because you know that these niggas is... If you work in the mall or yeah. something in these stores, I'm telling you, these niggas is probably paying niggas like, yo, bro, if you hear See from anybody, yeah, let just me call know, me. Bro. Yeah, just hit me. Come on, give me and a And I'll drop. pull up. I'll exactly. You. I'll give you Come $500. On, Come on, these niggas is making worth way yeah, more. 100000 nigga in Foot Locker making bread. Yeah. <laughs> he see the nigga walking. Yo, this nigga yeah, just yeah. walked in, bro. Ronda That's just it. left. 
Yeah. <laughs> you you know walking around the mall. You got 30 minutes to get here. Yep. You know what I'm saying, I bro? I see Maserati keys. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Them niggas on the drop. For real. Oh, can I get a picture? You would think they just a regular Not fan, even. Bro. They could take the picture with you and send it to the nigga. And be like, yeah, like yo, this him. him. This he's him. I'm going to hold him here. Yeah. I'm they could just send, him. They could just send the they picture. Do they don't even got to text or nothing. Yeah. They could just snap the picture, send the picture, bro. You got to take yo. a shot on that, though, because it's wicked Word. out here in these streets. All around they good P&B, boy. No T. Grizzly. Yeah, nigga. He got, he got robbed. His crib got robbed. But was this in L.A., too? I believe so. I, be, I don't want to be wrong, but I believe it was in L.A. But they took a million dollars worth of jewelry. To me, it sound like an insurance fraud right there. Like trying to get, you know what I'm saying? Because think about it. T. Grizzly, he's making money off of the Twitch situation and all of that, right? Mm -hmm. And he got it popping. I ain't going to lie. But he, when did you hear him have a single or anything that's popping in the past? Nah, but he really is big, bro. Yeah, he because he, he is. He is. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. His his robbery shit was mm -hmm. trending higher than Young Boy in on YouTube for uh -huh. a little bit yesterday. Yeah, that is a fact. I so I crazy. seen that because I was checking, like, because I, I look mm -hmm. at Young Boy. Cause you know he usually number one. Yeah. So when I seen it, and he just dropped too, right? Yeah, he just dropped some song mm -hmm. and shit. So I was looking, and I'm like, it said he was like number seven or some shit. So I was like, hold up, Young Boy mm -hmm. seven. Because you know he independent now, mm -hmm. so it's like they play these funny games. Mm -hmm. So I was like, independent? So I'm like, I mean, number seven. So I was like, let me see what's number one. So I seen number one, which was some fucking, some Japanese rap chicks. They like, they sound like Cardi B. This is yeah. some crazy shit. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> this shit did 67 million views in one day. This song, bro. The Japanese? Yes, thing? bro. I've bro. never seen nothing like this, bro. Hey, y'all tap in. Y'all check that shit. Yeah, that, whatever <laughs> the fuck that shit is, y'all should know about it. Mm -hmm. 67 people watching, million watching in one day. But anyway, Crazy. and he was number two or three. He was like yeah. two or three, the robbery shit. Mm -hmm. So, like, I, he do doing his, he do his numbers, bro. Independent. I fact. think he might be independent, too. I think he might be. After um, who was that that passes? Aunt that was managing yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah, I think yeah. he did. But that's that whole situation mm -hmm. is just crazy to me because it's like they say he dropped the song like four days before that called robbery, yeah. and then his crib ended up getting busted. In, you know, mm -hmm. like they say, the power of the tongue is everything. Yeah, yeah, you know that's what, what he was saying honestly yeah. when he made his video. Like, be careful what you speak, what you speak. And really, that's why I always try to speak motivation Positive and greatness shit, yeah, bro. into like, existence, I don't want to bro. speak none of that crazy exactly, shit Exactly, because, life, bro. bro, that shit really do be following mm -hmm. you, bro. I ain't that's gonna hold you when you talking about shit. Mm -hmm. And that's why that rap shit is just dangerous, bro. Even yeah, like Bobby, I seen around. yesterday, like, this nigga laying in a casket and all that. And it's like, it's fun you for the be, theatrics yeah. and look the imagery the and all that. who did that and really was in the casket. <laughs> yeah. XXX. Nigga. Remember he did yeah. that video? He, did, he died before the video exactly. came out. Exactly. And they had to release that. And it was like, and everybody was even more sad. Because and he has been doing that a few times. And exactly, it's like some pop bro. shit. Exactly. Two niggas Pac was be like, seeing they death probably. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, but these niggas is into shit. That's it ain't seeing saying. they death. It's just that these niggas be into bro. shit. Bro. That be the thing. Let's break it down. You for can't real. be a rapper gangster. You think that niggas will learn from Tupac? And if you think about it, that's the part that they glorify, like yeah. the rapper gangster. But Tupac, they don't really glorify. This nigga was a poet. This nigga Pac did ballet. Yeah, all he did all shit. He was at Juilliard and all yeah, that. Yeah, man. That nigga wasn't no gangster. He learned the art of everything before he went to the music. Mm -hmm. That nigga knew how to act, do everything. Yeah, bro. bro. How you think he got the role on Juice? Yeah, he was lit. They say he was a walk-on. He was with Omar Ebbs. And Omar already got the part. They was like, yo, who's your mans right there? And this nigga came, blew that shit through, became big. Nah, Park is fire, bro. You get Park what I'm fire, saying? But at the Everybody same time, said that. But they glorify his gangsters. Everybody that try to copy what he do, they copy the gangster it. part. Yeah. And, and which like, he was only gangster for what, a year? And yeah, niggas clapped him? He, he <laughs> like was only gangster when he went to LA. Being real. And 
It's he was always kick. Don't get me wrong. He was yeah, always he was militant. About that shit. Yeah, he was about that. He was shit. always militant, but he ain't start picking up that gangster shit, gang banging mm-hmm. shit till he start getting in the yeah. that California politics. Been in his blood, you know the the Black yep. Panther shit, his mother and all that. You but know niggas what I'm try to embrace when they talk about Pac and embracing Pac imagery and who's the new Tupac. They always compare that shit onto they got the gangster stop, shit, bro. They got yeah, because he was way more than that. The These nigga niggas. died at twenty five. Right, no nigga was talking like that at. 25 before yeah. 25 and then doing what they did who who you know gonna shoot at police bro yeah but to he protect was, another to be, be clear he ain't know they was cops they exactly. was undercover but they still was like he was protecting duty. another person yeah the the day, see, nobody's gonna see, do that bro two nigga two white boys beating up a nigga he, and he, he went and protected yeah him. yeah you get now what niggas is seeing two niggas beating up a, a, a they pull up they phone. Phone. Oh, yeah. that's wild yeah. wow, bro yeah you feel what I'm saying you at all. he like oh oh he was dying nigga they were sitting there instead of trying to hold up the bullet wounds niggas is out they phone yo he's dying bro in front but of me yo but crazy. this but bro what do I, what's the <laughs> number one thing i always say <laughs> At yeah. all, every episode, bro. It's the it's the system. They it's instinct. Yeah, it's what the this is what your mind because this is what you see in other. This is what you looking at all day on social all day, media, bro. Nigga, you pulling phone out phones shit. when you yeah. see tragedy. Mm-hmm. So at the same time, this is programmed in your brain that you when you see phone. tragedy, it's not to run to help. It's pull to pull out, out your phone. phone. It's a reaction. This is what they're training. This is what they train for. This is what I'm trying to explain to you. We dealing with some masterminds when it comes to this shit. Mm-hmm. You feel me? They not showing nah, you, you niggas that, that's yeah, flat right. for no reason. I'm right. telling you, they not right. showing you this shit for no reason. We play, we play rap music on the page for five minutes. Them niggas chopped our shit. Bro, you right. Yo, yo I just got my live nigga. Back, yo, niggas is <laughs> clapping niggas. That shit. I'm telling you, bro. I'm seeing a page with multiple followers. I, with, I ain't with, no rap, but I'm yeah. just saying. I see pages Trust me, bro. with niggas Trust just me. laid out clapped. And, and they, they still got the page going. Bro, and they, bro, I remember, bro, it was some it was like rotten.com. That mm-hmm. one, and there was some shit called being from TV. <laughs> I remember I finessed my grandfather to buy it. You feel yeah. me? It's some shit called being, <laughs> being from TV. That was the craziest shit, bro, that niggas ever seen. If they niggas know what I'm talking about. Yeah. It was a video, it was a it was a cassette tape, like a video VCR tape, bro. And that shit, bro, this was some shit that we see regular now. I'm talking about it was shit like niggas getting hit by trains. Oh shit. We finished my grandma like, yo, yeah, order that. He was like, yo, we want to see what happened. Bro, we seen this lady walking, my by we like, yo. This was, bro, this is like 90-something, bro. Oh, yeah. This is like the first That's time. crazy. But now, bro, this is... Banned from TV. Banned from <laughs> TV, bro. This that, um, That's a wrap. I ain't gonna hold you. It was so crazy at the time. Niggas, um, big pun and all that. And um, I think Nori on it, too. They made a song called Banned from TV. Classic yeah. joint, too. You feel me? That, that they named that for That's how crazy this shit was at the time. Now, this is something we see every day on Instagram. I'm not even yeah. gonna hold you. But yeah, so man. It's like... What's going on with Blueface, bro? This nigga boxing up, <laughs> he knocking niggas out. He going crazy, like yeah. I see he over here popping. What's it called? Uh, popping off on her pops. Yeah, but he hit him first though. Yeah, that's, I see that's that. what I heard. So I'm ch- I'm trying to think. Even though the pops swung on him first, right? Do mm-hmm. he still get the opportunity to uh, sue? Blueface, even though he's nah, swung, like it's over. They ain't with. no suing nothing, bro. They ain't no suing nothing. That was a family. A family get together. In other words, you know, families mm-hmm. gotta have their shit. You know, you get what I'm saying? Yeah. And shit like that was. I mean, didn't she pop off on his mom's? Yeah, they be and wild. the sister, right? Yeah, they, they have a weird toxic relationship. Them is the new Bobby and Whitney. Right but there. people buying into it, and I feel like that's the dangerous thing that's too. That's the only reason it's why keeping I said them relevant. They this, people, bro. people keep the society like social media. Yeah. They keeping them relevant. Like shorty uh, followers is up ever since they started being public yeah, and bro. all that extra shit. So people benefit, bro. It's the it's worshiping money. Cause niggas, bro, bro, niggas will rather live in turmoil and be unhappy and be fucking Happy miserable, internet, bro. Nah, but it's be miserable internet. just to have money, bro. Nah, this is right. a perfect example. Like you can't tell me Blueface is happy, bro. 
Like all yeah, this is what he got to deal with, bro. All this shit he got to deal with, bro. bro. You can't even really tell me like Shorty happy cuz I don't think they going to be together forever. Like she waiting, she going to take off like she's doing cuz she's starting to as far as like you see it, the popularity like it's she off, Yeah, bro. she's starting to be like Cardi B as all she got to do really is come out with the right song and yeah. she's out of here. I think when she yeah, gets she to that, artist, right? yeah, I think artist, when yeah. she get that, she's gonna dip on Blueface, bro. Mm-hmm. So it's just like, and that's worshiping what the money, bro. Exactly. So they will, they money. both going through whatever because you know, they both like chasing. I tell you, like I said, the remember last episode, I be feeling like mm-hmm. all this shit be a contract, bro. Like all these artists and everything, it be a contract. They get together, be knowing what it be. Oh yeah, we going viral. Yo, this is what it's gonna be. Yeah, bro. I don't know. Paid. You get paid. You get paid from they going viral. Paid, bro. Yeah, they, they of course they get paid for. Every time they get paid. Yeah, but they and they get paid for like um uh appearances and shit. But of course. but him fighting her fucked up his big bag with the boxing shit. So she be fucking up not his even. bag. Not even. I think he's still gonna get that bag. Yeah, but he remember Nick Young fought some other nigga like last week or two weeks ago. Up, yeah, he got knocked out the <laughs> ring. Blueface would have beat that nigga up, but he fucked Blueface back. She fucked. Blueface face bagger from you from them like, fighting and shit like so? remember they got into it he was supposed to fight nick young last week but oh, yeah, right, but he right, got right, thrown right. off the fight he about to fight somebody else but it's just like they took him off the fight because of that situation like she fucking his bag up that's what i'm saying she but i'm telling you bro this is this is the sick shit that goes on she yeah. gonna she gonna Fuck around and demo- look, make Blueface look bad, bro, to the public. I don't. She's gonna kill his image and mm-hmm. use that to catapult her career, bro. I'm telling you. Yeah. It come you out see, with a record. She gonna interview get a record. Did, what was that interview she did on Revolt? Was it Revolt? She know. did. She just waiting on the song. If you ask me, she just waiting on the right song. Cause she giving out that sad story about yeah, her life that and that Cardi everything. B shit, bro. It's like, bro, I don't want to hear. About they got that nine. Shit. Her got, kids got. Her parents got fourteen kids. She like the second to youngest, so she I got a story. I don't want to hear about a shorty that got anger problems. Learn how to deal with your shit. Like, she just young and angry. Yeah, shit happened to you in the past. Like, everybody got shit that happened to them. You just got to learn how to deal with your anger. All this shit that she looking like is just a kid that just ain't never deal with their emotions the right nah, way. But bro, one thing about what what do we buy into? This was the reason why reality TV was created. Yeah. You got people buying into... You, go ahead, bro. Yeah, do your yeah, thing, yeah, bro. Yeah. I'm, whatever you doing, I'm matching it. Yeah. You feel me? But at the same time, like everybody is buying into people's lives. Yeah. So this is what people that you're not even peeping. This is what they sac they sacrificing their life mm-hmm. for the bag. So point. now I gotta live in the public. So now you gotta know my business. You gotta know you feel me? What happened? Blueface knocked out her pop. She talked about, <laughs> oh, he made he made my mom scream. For hours, she ain't talking about. She ain't talking about nothing good he did. This yeah. is the same shit she gonna pull on blue. This is what they do. The same thing with Coyle Ray, bro. Mm-hmm. She she profited off her pops. Benzino, yeah, shit. Benzino but, was a uh, lit pops. Time He's, out, time out. When they, she said that though, even the moms backed it up and said Benzino on, wasn't bro. in the life the like moms that. Moms was gonna back it up. Oh, yeah, you right. Because right, she's right. in the yeah, position, right, bro. Right, Look right, at what right, Benzino. Right. Yeah, let me not. Yeah, yeah you bugging because. Obviously, it had to be him. You think to get Benzino, in, in Benzino, the industry bro, that far, bro? Benzino was worth a half a billion dollars, bro. Nah, you right, think that right, his kid right. was fucked up? Nah, Let's keep it real, nah, bro. Nah. So, and yo, bro, who was he, making? Yeah. Everybody know Benzino. Everybody go through hard making, bro. times, yeah, bro. When you fact. young, black, and you that's not fact, educated, bro. and you come from the hood, bro. Yeah. This is what this is what is designed for us, bro. You you could have a. Uh, half a billion dollars and you could fuck it up if you yeah. don't have direction if you yeah. don't if you're the man That's and the everybody fact, is around you like yes sir yes bro, sir yeah, niggas, you the boss niggas could relate bro niggas yeah. fucked up money that they know they they've they been put in position you make a quick 10 this 20 is, listen, and you do the wrong thing you go to sacks bro niggas go to sacks first before and they then, think a little LS and then it's not only you know them saying? if 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 Benzino only took care of himself, mm-hmm. he would be rich right He'll now. He'd be up, bro. Yeah, it's everybody else that come along with it, bro. Mm-hmm. He done raised Carla Ray mama kid that wasn't his. That nigga, come on, bro. It's yeah, like situations happen. Shit, you it fall always get off, turned back on the public happened. figure. It you always fall off, yeah. but you fall off. 
and then niggas shit on you when you can't maintain fact, the lifestyle that you created for niggas from before. Bro, she had a record deal at like six or something. Like, mm. this is no way her pops... I, I don't hold back, like, and I ain't yeah, trying to yeah, defend yeah. him because Benzino is weird. Yeah, he be <laughs> yo. I don't know where yeah. he be getting caught up in. The, but it's in just the like I, don't, I would never believe a half. If you didn't have kids out, like some secret shit, and you got a wife over here, and you got some kids over there somewhere, yeah. that's the only way I see it. But he was with the moms; they had a crib and all that, bro. That I felt like he just fucked his bag up, and it that's, happens. That's what happens, bro. A lot of times, bro. <laughs> that's a fact. Niggas Take a just shot need to a, that. Sometimes. Niggas just need to call you bankruptcy. Fuck, niggas fuck the bag up, but you Word. gotta bounce. <laughs> back bro you gotta fucking call bankruptcy back. man get your money back just like 50 did like three times bro you know what you I'm gotta saying? bounce back look at 50 that nigga don't fuck with his son at all but that little nigga probably still straight we don't know he up bro probably he done up. blew his bag that's what happened his whatever yeah. bag his pops had for him his mom and him done ran through it that's, that's another fact. thing bro so that's it's like bro we we don't know if Benzino said, here, here's 100000 to the mom, mm -hmm. it ain't like she took the 100000 invest in Cora Ray. They want to be fly, too. Yeah. They want to, you feel me? Especially if you that nigga and you ain't fucking with them no more, they want to mm -hmm. still be up and feel like some somebody. Exactly, so what bro. they doing? Blowing the bag. Exactly. Blowing, buying this bag, these shoes. Like, come on, bro. Let's keep it a buck, bro. Speaking like, of like some it. shit being overlooked. This nigga Bobby, um, <laughs> this nigga Bobby career might be over if this shit, Yo. Is, if he's linked in with this situation with this, this and Bobby a yard nigga, so I don't know, bro. I don't think this I don't believe, is, I don't bro. believe, I don't bro. believe, bro. I don't, Let me just put that on believe. record. I don't think he's gonna go that far and record that joint. Mm -hmm. Nah, man. Nah, man. I don't think nah, so. Y'all need to stop playing with Bobby, yo. Please. And then he came with another video trying to play with niggas too, like since they played on his top. I think he 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 dropped another video, I think, last night with some more chicks in the bed talking about and niggas was like, yo, you ain't learned your lesson? Bro, that wasn't no boy. That nigga that was on that shit was just trying to get clout. Like you said, the internet is a drug, bro. Mm -hmm. Niggas he know if so he was his Bobby was like one of his somebody he knows sent them a yo, picture. Yo, you look like, like this. Yeah, they was like, That's you? <laughs> <laughs> and that nigga just took that shit and mm -hmm. ran with that shit, bro. There's no way, bro. There's no way Bobby on that type of time. Come on, man. Bobby got too much. He he got too much to live for, bro. That's what I'm saying. They trying to slam them, my and boy. And my boy just got out. You don't think he trying to fuck every poom poom that's around, bro? Nah, like he got crazy. white girls, black girls. Oh, he's yo, this going nigga crazy. Some Playboy shit, that's bro. What I'm saying, don't do my son like yo, that. Stop playing with Bobby. Stop playing yo. with Bobby. Ty, like bro. for real. But that, but then you start thinking like, damn, the Fabio the, the and industry shit. shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You be like, oh, oh man. man, like what's going on? Talk to me. And Talk he just went me. independent, so you never know, bro. That Talk. money ain't coming like that. Lego Talk. money different. Talk to me. <laughs> Talk about it. But you know, I'm defending Bobby, though. You yeah, know what me I'm saying? Too. We, we defending that. Bobby. Fuck yeah, all that. Yeah, fuck all we that. We don't believe all that. Fuck all that. Hell nah. Hell nah. But not. it's like, even if that is you, Bobby, live your truth, bro. Yeah, live your truth. That's what I'm going to say. To any real nigga, live your motherfucking truth, bro. But yeah. I fuck with you, Bobby. Like, don't do that. Yeah, yeah. Stop playing. Don't go out like playing, that. Man. Don't let these niggas let you go out like yeah, that, man. bro. Not on, not on my court. You kept it real. You kept yeah. it real from the beginning to you now. Feel me? So don't Seven let us years, fuck right? down, bro. Yes, bro. Seven years. Don't bro. let us down, bro. Stay strong, bro. You gonna be all right. You gonna yeah, be all right. Bro. You gonna build this, bro. That's a fact. You drop a single. Yeah. <laughs> not even. You gonna be all right, bro. Yeah. You gonna be all right. Yeah. You don't, don't, don't do that. Don't yeah, do that. That's a fact. Yeah, but don't try to defend yourself and all this. Just let it rush over, cause next week there's gonna be something else crazy that we gonna be talking about. So you know what I'm saying, Bobby. Don't even pay into that. Keep fucking your bitches, doing what you're doing, bro. Yo, I ain't gonna lie though, son. That nigga, you think Tory Lanez is like that, bro? <laughs> yeah, when, my, lie, when my boy called him before, four eleven leprechaun came and, and, and punched the shit out of him. Nah, but he be running down on niggas. I ain't gonna lie. Yo, Tory ran like down. That, bro. He ran down on on Travis Scott, bro. Bro, bro Tory's like camera. that, bro. I met him in person one time. Oh, what? In the, in the airport. This was oh. when before Say It was out and all that. Mm. This was when I worked for Miami International, bro. I ran up on a nigga. I had mm -hmm. the badge. And I was like, yo, let me see a ticket. Mm -hmm. I scared him. Mm -hmm. Just trying to play it off. Mm -hmm. And I'm just like, nah, bro, I ain't nobody important. I just laughed and was just talking with him. He was a cool dude. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And from that, I knew he was... The nigga was on that because the look he gave me was like... Yo, I'm not with the shits right now. And Yo. he was he was on the overseas side. So he was mm. going to Spain or something for like a tour or something. Mm. 
So, you know, and he was flying at Miami International, bro. This is before anybody would have really noticed him. I fuck, I fuck with you that, You know what I'm man, saying? Man. And he was like that. So, Tory liked that, Tory bro. Tory got some classics, man. Some shit that I don't Stop fucking... Stop playing with Tory, some man. shit through, Yeah, man. you play Tory, bro. Stop got some <laughs> shit through fucking with Tory, bro. Tory that gave the vibes, too. Yeah, bro. that's Facts, bro. Tory that gave me really both talented, sides. Bro. He done gave both sides. He done gave me some gangster shit. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. soft shit, bro. Yeah, he Get done you gave through, me some bro. shit. Yeah, he made me... Yeah, he got me through there, bro. I ain't mm -hmm. gonna lie, so... I, I ain't got no negativity on Troy except like whatever he got going on. But you feel me mm -hmm. with this with with Shorty? Cause I feel like Shorty trying to play him on that too and capitalize off that. I feel mm -hmm. like that's more than obvious. And fuck of course. Him. This nigga smacking up August Alcina. August probably needed that, bro. Yeah, he did, bro. Yeah, yeah. August sleeping with niggas wild, But bro. not only that, he been August Alcina been playing tough for years, bro. Like yeah, yeah, he has. Now bro. he told you heard him though. He was talking crazy, but he was like, yeah, I was paralyzed for two months. Yeah, and all yeah, yeah. That, he like he making excuses for getting washed by Tory, bro. He like put out the video. <laughs> I gotta see that. Tory dropped that, bro. But Tory, this is not like Tory that, got heat right now, so he probably not gonna put that video. Yeah, out, of course, bro. of course he not. I don't even know why Tory ran down knowing he got this heat on him. You yeah, me saying? too. Like, that would be, if like, that's the on, truth, bro. and facts, if that's the truth, Tory. Yeah, Tory, yeah that's bro. a legend fact. You know what I'm saying, but at the same time, if that's the truth, bro. Like Tory, you wildin', bro. Not for that goofball, bro. bro. That nigga's this a nigga goofy. This nigga would have handled him, That's bro. a fact. Like, he was going to get his, bro. Like, yeah. he just beat this nigga up for no reason. <laughs> That's fucked Yo, up, Tori. If he smacked Chris. Tori be getting bitches beat up, too. Right? I ain't going to talk about that bitch he got beat nah, up. Bro. That's Tory why niggas got to stop playing with Tori, yeah, bro. Yeah, stop playing he with Tori. He be fucking them in the Tori will laugh, bro. bro. He just know how to sing. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, Tori. Yeah. He's still with the street yeah, shit, Tori, bro. Yeah, Tori has some gangster shit. Yo, I ain't gonna hold you, bro. That's a fact, Tori bro. Tori be tapped in, too, so that nigga go some gangster shit. But yeah, shout out to Tori. Yo, like, that's bro. a... You putting out heat and giving niggas the beats. <laughs> <laughs> that's a fact. That's a fact. Nah, wow. Yeah, man. But yo, speaking of niggas getting... Yeah, your man Charleston White <laughs> allegedly... Well, I had a legend in Charleston. He got the shirts out, so he yeah. came in the air. I guess it happened. Nigga shot himself in the leg in the Boy shirt. popped himself in the club, bro. That, that nigga shit weird, is though. wild. Yeah, he's weird. What? They said, nah, they said the nigga was scared because he seen niggas approaching him that look shaky. I mean, yeah, you see niggas approach you, but damn, bro, keep your shit on safety until you know it's a go. Dark, you know what if I'm he saying? got a glizzy, that shit yeah, ain't yeah, got that, Yeah, yeah, yeah. It depends what gun he got. Mm -hmm. But the guns he... Described in the other interview. He ain't carrying that in no strip club. Yeah. I'm surprised he even got his gun in the strip club. That's what so I'm saying. Thinking that he... Security or whatever it is. Y'all yeah, yeah. niggas ain't doing y'all job. He just blew y'all up. Y'all spot yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. They probably let him go in. Like, you know, he a celebrity. And they probably nah. know he an activist. He ain't just nah. gonna lie. But I ain't gonna lie. Guess yeah. what? Him shooing himself probably saved him from embarrassing himself. Because it. imagine all this... Mm -hmm. love and all this love for this person this person that he always showing and positivity that he speak on the opposite side of where he aim his anger towards rappers and yeah. gang members mm -hmm. what that shit is not gonna look good for him if he just clapped them niggas in the strip club now, first right. of all he's not supposed to have no gun in there you mm. feel me as far as as far as I would think, you know what I'm saying? And not, a, and a, yeah, cuz they not bro. letting niggas in the strip club with straps. So I, I know Texas ain't that free. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? And for him to do that, on another note, it's just like, it would be fun. His whole image, his whole idea of everything would be killed. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because that's the thing. When you put out this negative yeah, energy, that something is yeah, something's about come to back, happen. Bro. Yeah, that's a fact. You, he like, yeah, come on, bring it. Like, <laughs> like my man Goodley was saying, like, you got to be careful of what you speak out here because you bring it, yeah, you bro. bringing that energy on. So... All these niggas, 6 9 he was talking crazy about PNB. Like, be careful, bro, because that energy, you, bro, niggas fuck gonna, all that. Fuck all that. It's gonna be, fuck the oh, algorithm it's gonna be your turn that. eventually. This nigga, 6 9 need to get clapped, bro. This nigga talk <laughs> crazy, bro. Like, I'm no, trying to say it's talk gonna crazy. Have, no, the thing is, 6 9 is gonna get clapped. He you needs feel me? You. Eventually. Yeah, bro. Because one thing that's nigga promised to us is death, bro. And the way how he's moving and the way how he's responding to things that he has nothing to do with. Mm -hmm. especially, you got to understand, homie. 
the day you decided to sign that paper and say, all right, I'm, I'm a rat. I'm willing to testify yes. on my people and yeah. send them to jail, the niggas that was doing whatever they had to do to protect me. Yeah. Once you decided and signed on to do that, you got to understand this is what comes with it. Mm -hmm. Niggas is going to say what how they feel about it. You're not going to be... Niggas, to me, surprisingly, he's getting way more love than I expected. I he's still really making money. Bro, he's still going on chilling. tour overseas. Yeah. He's still going on niggas tour. Niggas love him, bro. Like, I feel like you know, should just appreciate that, bro. I'm nah, just saying that he You know what just, it is? Is the niggas... There's other soft niggas from the suburbs or whatever it is that mm -hmm. feel like, oh, yeah, he snitched. And he did it on people. Oh, I could do that too. Let me just con continue to show the love. Mm -hmm. But where where six nine came from? Bushwick. Yeah, he can't even. You get go what there. I'm saying? You, you can't, can't even go. Y'all gotta it. look at that type of shit. But y'all still showing him love. And this nigga told but on the everybody. From is that, showing bro. him love. Niggas it's ain't real niggas. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. Not, it's not. But real niggas why is like it? Nigga? Why is he still prospering, bro? That's no, the thing, bro. Because, bro they all these other rats. The got people cut that's out, allowing bro. him to prosper is people that come from the shit that we don't come from. So I can't blame them for liking a nigga music because that's crazy. Before bro. Six Nine signed them papers, six, you gotta think Six Nine was the hottest nigga in the industry. Think about it. Think about it too. And he was being think black about it. and hated think on. Think about it too. I ain't gonna. I'm gonna admit I was fucking with Six Nine. I was too. He I was it. too. All of us. All of us. Bobby Swaggin' the niggas, niggas, niggas was bro. locked up. The yeah. We, we didn't have back. nothing else. Exactly. We have nothing going on. That was popping. And he gave, it, through, he gave it a shine from New York. Right. He That's came a through fire, with a wave. Bro. Bigger after than a shine. Boogie. After A Boogie. Yeah, he yeah. was like the next big but thing. But niggas that was, was taking fucking us. with him. A Boogie linked with him. Exactly. Made him bro. even more lit. Fetty Wap. Exactly. All these niggas, bro. Exactly, bro. Come on, son. But that nigga, tell me this, though. Tell me this, though. What's the difference between 6 9 and Alpo? Alpo showed love, nah, took nah. care of people, but he snitched. Nah, on a, on a, on nah, a nah, lot nah, of nah. a lot of people and murders, that's the bro. Problem. That's the you but see? what's the difference between nah, six nine, nah, bro? I'm tell you right now. That's the issue. That's that's the issue mm -hmm. with what's going on today because of that because of social media and the internet. Yeah, niggas is comparing six nine a rap. This nigga used to work in a fucking bodega. That's a fact. To a nigga that was selling a thousand bricks a week mm -hmm. and build a fucking drug empire. It's not the same. You can't compare this rap shit to a nigga that put in work, killed mm -hmm. niggas, had niggas killed, was selling work, and then he turned around and was like, yo, I can't do life in jail. I can't get to face the death penalty. I'm snitching on niggas. It's not the same as a nigga that hang with a couple of gangster niggas for a couple of months. And then he turn around and rat on niggas, and he he's just a rapper, bro. He don't want to live, bro. That nigga want to die. He, he he. That's what I'm saying. He's, he's gonna get clapped news, because yeah. he's making himself accessible. Nah, because you know what? Clap. He know what he did, and he know what where where we come from. He know the consequences of that. Right. So he know it's gonna come one day. That's why he's living. And doing but what he's he doing, rap, bro. bro. It, I feel like them them niggas from the the Treyway niggas. When just was just doing too much, niggas mm -hmm. is greedy, bro. Like these niggas was robbing him. Niggas allegedly was fucking his baby moms. Allegedly robbing him. Man, and that nigga pussy, And it was bro. just like at the same time. I, let me tell you what they probably what how they ended up in the situation because mm -hmm. it no longer became about six nine. Yeah. It wasn't about the business. Six nine just got caught up in that shit being so around the nigga. Yeah. You feel what he I'm saying? The face blowing it up. Yeah, That's but he's the it name. It's no different yeah. than what's going on right now in Atlanta. Course, you feel course, me? Bro. But what I'm saying is, six nine, mm -hmm. six nine ain't have that shit was between them niggas, and that's what made shit spicy. Is that when it comes to the bag, niggas worshiping the bag, it's Boy, always gonna yeah. be a problem because nigga, the bag will make niggas morally fucked. The bag made Al Poe kill his man. Yeah. Nigga that he on on a picture kissing. You know P. Rich Porter, man. Yeah, man. But at the same time, this is what I'm trying to show you. Like, at the end of the day, you fucking 6 9 ain't on the pedigree of Al Poe, bro. Well, nah, Al Poe right, then was right, way right. more serious. Nah, right. I just want to make but it I'm clear. I'm just saying, they, both, they both clarified as rats. 
You know yeah, what I'm saying? You, you make that tone. Nah, but this is what I'm saying. If you could uh, but with uh, forgive nine, one rap, that, but let me why, tell you. why you can't forgive the next But at one? the same time, what did 6 9 tell him? He, what he told long was that already... That was crazy, bro. No, but what listen, he told, what though. he told long was... What, what niggas did to him. <clears throat> no. He didn't have to tell... This is what I'm trying to show you, bro. <laughs> he didn't have to tell... Mm-hmm. On what niggas did to him? Yeah, let's just clarify because. He, but he just did listen, that. Listen, yeah. listen, listen, listen. What I'm saying? Because the video, the the car that niggas came and kidnapped him in was mm-hmm. wired in surveillance oh, because okay. his driver, the driver was, was wired already up. flipped with the yeah. FBI. That's a fact. So let's get that out the way. Yeah. So all six nine did was confirm information. As far six nine only testified against two niggas: the nigga that robbed him and the nigga that didn't fuck with him like that. That's a fact. Let's keep it real. Let, like, let, let's be let's be clear. He told on a nigga that he ain't fuck with like that, and he told on a nigga that kidnapped him. Mm-hmm. If six nine wouldn't have said nothing, the other niggas copped out. They were smart. They copped out. Shotty copped out. The other nigga copped out and took his time. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? And they they. They doing what they got to do. Because they know this little nigga was going to tell. Yeah. But as far as what 6 9 told was all public information because of the way niggas live their life on social media. I'm going to just keep it real. Yeah, and the nigga yeah, that yeah. kidnapped him mm-hmm. was already on camera. He six When the nigga grabbed him, 6 9 on camera said, you a Why are you doing that? Mm-hmm. It's over with. That's a fact. So if they would have killed 6 9 they would have went to jail for that for life without 6 9 testimony. Mm-hmm. You feel me? I'm going to just keep it real on that part. Like 6 9 and a street nigga that did whatever he did and lived street life and gangs of life ain't the same thing as a rap nigga, a kid that's trying to get in, trying to get his shit to pop and fuck with some real niggas and then niggas doing the funny shit. If niggas would have kept it 100 and kept them separate from all yeah. that... They would have been eating. Everybody would have been, been out. It would have been bigger. Like, niggas, bro. I'll just say niggas mishandled that. 6 9 still told on. Mm-hmm. Or he just confirmed their information. These niggas that did whatever they did, the feds already knew that. And they already yeah. had niggas that. They had a case built up. Yeah, bro. already. Already, Because the main nigga that was ratting on them, that mm-hmm. niggas stopped talking about. Meaning he probably back in the field working and, in, and doing undercover work. That's locking right. up some neck, working on some other niggas. So y'all better be careful. The CEO Chris nigga is the real nigga that took down them niggas. Mm. Cause they was dealing with him. He was selling drugs. They gave him position. They wasn't fucking with six nine. They pushed this six nine shit. <clears throat> Pardon me, but they pushing that six nine shit. Mm-hmm. I feel like to take the word off his son. But at the end of the mm. day, he's the real nigga that brought the niggas that went down on trial down. Cause they the ones that did business with him. Mm. But God, we could. We could go ahead, bro. Whatever we talk about now. I don't want to... You feel me talking yeah, about this now? Nah. Too much, yo. But nah, that, that's really it. Bro. That's really yeah, it? That's it. Yeah. That's it, man. So, you know what that... Every episode is sponsored by Born Original. Man. Yeah, man. Make sure y'all tap it, man. And I'm out here in the streets, man. All my people, especially my folks that watch, mm-hmm. make sure y'all get with me, especially if y'all fuck with the gravel. I'm pulling up on you and dropping yeah, it. Yeah, put on. it in the camera. Yeah, man. Make sure That's y'all see it, man. It's sealed and all that, too. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. We it ain't it. no regular yeah, shit, bro. Yeah, we pushing P. It's not regular, bro. We pushing P, nigga. We That's pushing product, product nigga. Bro. Free my nigga gunner. And it's fresh. Yeah, free you my feel nigga gunner. Free my nigga thug, man, because we pushing P, nigga. But nah, what's the what's the last message? We got to give these niggas a message, bro. Man, I'm tired of giving these niggas messages because I don't know They don't be listening, it. bro. Yeah. I don't think these niggas be listening for real, bro. Be safe. Listen, bro. Especially listen, bro. If you getting money, bro. Yo, bro. If you go in, if you, bro, do not wear your jewelry. Don't pull out your That's whole fact, set to bro. go eat chicken and waffles. That's in a the fact. Hood. That's number one. We ain't promoting jewelry no yeah, more. Yeah, yeah. Bro, 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 listen, bro. nah, but fuck that. Because, nigga, we like, nigga, niggas like nice shit. Niggas, yeah, niggas yeah, like yeah. jewelry. Niggas don't want go they crazy, wives. though, bro. No, but this is what I'm saying. This, mm-hmm. It's not about being, I'm trying to show you, it's not about being soft. It's not about a nigga. Saying like, yo, bro, I could wear my jewelry anyway because nigga, nigga really on on real life on real timing, you could do whatever the fuck you want to do. That's a fact. But you just got to think about what you mean to your people and the consequences of you doing that. Cause mm-hmm. yeah, it could go good. You could wear all your jewelry, come out, bust down crazy, pop out, and shit be lit, and then you have a good night. Mm-hmm. But think about the shit that might the can happen days, the just because cause jewelry and all that icy shit, that shit lit, but it adds attention. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That make the nigga 
The bum nigga way in the back that really ain't getting no love. Bitches don't like him. That's what make him look at you. And mm -hmm. he seeing all the love you get. So he's sitting back. He's seeing the bottle bitches come with the sparkles. That nigga, that nigga is mm -hmm. hurting. <laughs> he hit his fucking feelings. You feel me? He looking at that shit. And then you motherfucking, you know what I mean? And you, 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 you get caught slipping like that. So I just mm -hmm. feel like if you going out. Cause you yeah. know a lot of niggas don't really party by themselves. So if you that type of nigga and you in that crowd or you in that move, you go out, move with your people, bro. And that's, that's when fact, you pull bro. out your jewelry at the end of the day. Cause you that's, know that's you when niggas do wrong, bro. They be you by themselves trying to do this shit. If you with your girl and y'all chilling, bro, you feel me? I say you feel me, especially in a place where you know where you going, you know what mm -hmm. type of area you feel me. So I say you feel me, move plain chain. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't no yeah. wrong with just wearing your regular robe that ain't bust niggas, down. Man, diamonds, diamonds depreciate the shit yeah, anyway, yeah. bro. You depre your shit is depre, but it's what people want to see. But at the Fuck end of the day, you that, already man. you already know who you are. Exactly. You already know what you got. You already know what you could do. You already know what you could pull out. You already know. So it's just like just think about it before you make those decisions with them situations, that That's location shit, and all that because. Niggas is hungry out here, bro, and it's only gonna get and worse. And y'all seeing that shit? That yeah, y'all seeing that shit play that out shit, with the bro. rapper. What happened when them niggas finish eating the rappers that they don't like? Cause they only mm -hmm. eating the rappers they don't like. What's imagine what's when, when the they niggas, start? Yeah. They gonna start going on some They gonna start pulling up in your crib. They gonna start crib, knocking bro. on regular niggas' cribs, bro. You gotta have it. You gotta be ready mm -hmm. to use it, type shit. And LA, a crazy, it, it's a hot place to live at anyway. Yeah, they yeah. knocking at your front door. Oh yeah, that shit grabbed that photo. Yeah. You, are, you need to go out there if you only on GTA timing. That's a fact. Yeah, if you got niggas with you and you know these niggas is straight Ooh, and ready niggas. to go. Yeah, yeah, that's a fact. They go tactical. to LA. Go to they LA. And they ain't wearing jewelry. Yeah, they ain't doing that. Cause you yeah. feel me? You need to make sure you move correct. If you were like that, you got to make sure the niggas you move with is like that. Mm -hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Don't be with the nigga that's flashy because he get the bitches. Mm -hmm. And he got jewelry too and you want to get in with him. That's because my time to tell you, he might be soft. And the goonies see you with him, that's your eye. That's they your gonna face click card. That nigga. They Not gonna even. Click that's your face card. Yeah. Now they looking at, oh, he with him. He pussy too. That's why you got to make sure you careful about Bro, it. Bro, that's how most shit go down. Yeah, they that's how you got you, they you got to one nigga in the group that's soft. Oh, yo. Yeah, because I ain't robbed him up, already. Yeah. You don't even know, but you want to be cool with him because he got the bitches. He got robbed said. already. So when the oh, to see you with him, it's over, they looking bro. at you like extra you food, meat, nigga. <laughs> looking at you like extra extra meat. They like, oh, that's a that's two a for fact. one. That's a Because I already got him. He giving it up. He ain't even tell you about it. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So just yo, bro. I can't. We can't stress this enough. Be careful and be aware of your surroundings. That's all That's I can fact, say. Man. And if, if you want to wear that ice, nigga, you gotta be a hot Defend boy. Defend your life. You gotta be ready to. You feel me? You gotta be ready to give it like that, bro. That's it. Because that's how niggas is coming towards you. And you, That's a fact. you feel me? It's predator and prey. That's you know fact. what I mean? So you just gotta move, move that way. Wear that ice if you want to be about that life. Hit him with a horn. Hit him with a horn, <laughs> man. That's a fucking fact. Man. With that ice, nigga, if you bought that life, nigga. Every nigga with a chain that I see, I want to know that he bought that life, that he ready to, you feel me? Fact. He moving milly. If you a weenie, if it happens to you, I'm not going to feel sorry for you. If you a weenie, you. I don't need you around If me, If you a weenie, I'm not going to feel sorry for you when it happens to you. Yes, bro. Because you should know better. Pop out plain Jane. Ain't nothing wrong with a Prezi with no ice. Mm -hmm. Niggas ain't even peeping that. They probably look at it. Oh, that's a fucking Seiko or some shit. Yeah. They are Casio. You I feel still me? want that. You a regular yeah. nigga. You know what I mean? But if you pop out Cuban to go yeah. get a slice of pizza and bust down Cartier and all that, mm -hmm. when that and you not like that, because the nigga, you, if you like that, you keeping it with you. Yeah, that's a fact. I don't that's care, fight, nigga. Bro. I'm in the park hooping with my son. It's on me. Yeah. Nigga, so if you not like that, and it's not on you 24-7, when it happens to you, don't expect us to feel sorry for you, nigga. That's it, nigga. And drop, drop that horn. Man. Yeah, drop that. <laughs> and you know, just like that, yo, it's episode 13, man. Yeah, man, appreciate y'all. Y'all niggas gotta be safe, man. Stay dangerous. Keep your shit on you. Fuck what them police say and all <laughs> that, man. Fact, yeah. We out here, yo. We out here. Shot up day, nigga. You be a nigga. Tough, right?